Hello guys, welcome to Bedwell channel. So guys, today was the second day of IEPS clerk pre-exam. Uh, now it's time to discuss slot 3 and slot 4. So let's analyze the exam and discuss the expected cutoff. Uh, in this video, we are discussing both the slots, slot 3 and slot 4, uh, because the level and pattern of the exam was exactly same. So let's begin with the, uh, the level. Uh, level of the, uh, these two slots was almost same as the previous slots, which was easy. So now let's see, uh, let's analyze the attempt. Here you can see on the screen. In English, if you have attempted around 14 to 17 question, then it is a good attempt. And level of English was easy. And in reasoning, around 19 to 23 attempts are good attempt. Uh, and in quant, Around 70 to 20 attempts are good attempts. Now let's see total attempts. If you have attempted around 59 to 63 questions, then it is a good attempt. In uh, quant was uh, level of quant was easy to moderate, and other two section English and reasoning was easy. So overall, the level of exam was easy. Now let's see. Uh, let's analyze the quant section. There were 5 questions from series which was of easy level and there were 15 questions from simplifications which was also easy and only one DI was asked in quant which was in which was of tabular chart form and there were 5 questions from DI which was of easy level. 10 questions from miscellaneous in which time and work averages, probability, ages, profit and loss, votes in stream questions were there and uh, level of uh, these miscellaneous were moderate so overall quant was easy to moderate let's see english section english was easy there were only three questions in english one was uh, reading comprehension and another was closed test and third one is errors reading comprehension and closed test were of uh, story based and there were 10 questions from rc and 10 from closed test and 10 from errors. Closed test was uh, easy to moderate and other two questions were easy. So overall English was easy. And uh, there were no fillers and fill in the blanks same as IPS PO pre. And uh, there's one uh, slight difference. There were no jumbled sentence in this section. Now let's see reasoning section. Reasoning was also easy there were five questions which was very direct of inequalities which was of easy level 15 questions from setting arrangement there were three arrangement in, uh, reasoning one was of circular setting arrangement and uh, second was of linear arrangement and third was of parallel setting total questions were 15 from setting arrangement and level of arrangements were easy to moderate and there were five questions from miscellaneous which was of easy level in miscellaneous questions were like dire uh, direction sense uh, distance and direction blood relation and there were five questions from alphabet coding which was of easy level five questions from alphanumeric series which was also easy so overall reasoning was of easy level and uh, there were no questions from slogs now let's see the expected cutoff in quant cutoff will be around uh, 10 to 13 marks and in reasoning it will be around 12 to 15 marks and in English it will be around 8 to 11 marks. These are sectional cutoff and uh, let's see the overall it will be around 50 to 55 marks. So guys uh, for all the aspirants of 3rd December and 4 December slots please stay tuned as we will upload a video on strategy to attempt paper on the basis of previous slots. So all the best for your preparation and thank you for watching this video.